how to install WSI on Windows 11 without Microsoft Store if you want to run any Android apps in Windows 11, then you will definitely need WSI for that. If you do not have WSI installed in your Windows 11, then you cannot run any Android applications on PC. So today I am going to tell you how to download WSI in Windows 11. So let's get started. So first of all you have to turn on a setting. If you want to run WSI in your PC, then for that you have to turn on the Virtual Machine Platform. So to turn it on, first of all you have to go to the search bar, there you have to search for Window Feature, then you have to open it as you see above. If you scroll down, you see the Virtual Machine Platform there. If the is on in your device, then it is correct. If it is not on, then you turn it on and restart PC once. After that we move ahead. If you have turned on this setting, then your PC is ready for Run WSA. So now, all you have to do is whatever link you see in the notepad, I have given it in the description. So from the description, or if you open the link and it in any of your web browsers, then your page will open. If you have to scroll down a bit, you will keep scrolling and you will see Window 11, then do 64-bit. If you are at the bottom, then after opening the link, you will have to go down again. So here you will see the first link which is remove Amazon 7-zip, then you have to download it or if you have 646 MB file then it will be downloaded, I have already downloaded it. So you are seeing the name, this is the one you have to download, where my file is downloaded, now ik you can right click on it and go to WinRAR option and you can extract it. After extracting it a folder is created. We'll go to whatever was inside it, so you can see that my WinRAR zip file extract has been has been done, now open a folder, after going inside this folder, if you scroll down a little, then here you will find the file containing run.bat, now you have to open it by double clicking, all the work will be done automatically, it will be installed, you do not have to do anything, then you can give your PowerShell has been started, the window will also be installed slowly. You can see now our such settings have already been turned on, so here you continue it. Then your other one will start, then all this work will be done slowly. If you are be patient, then it may take some time for your loading. You should be continuous, don't tamper with it. So you can see that the settings like this have been opened here, so we have nothing to do with the settings, so we will remove it and cancel it. Then you can remove it by continuing, you can see, now your Play Store is installed. So your sign in button has come here, so you sign in. Here you enter your email and you can sign in. You can give it if it is working perfectly, so here we enter your email. If you are saying that there was a... Now we will enter your email correctly. You enter the password of your email here. After everything is done, after giving the password, whatever, if in your phone. When your email is logged in, it tells you a number, you give that number, you click on agree, your account will be created in it. Then your Play Store will be activated. Now you can see that our Play Store will be activated separately. Is done and you can see below. If our account has been created there, then all our contacts which tell us that we have been there, then you can see that our Play Store is working perfectly here without any problem. You can download whatever you want from here. Thank you for staying till now in the video. Thanks for watching our video. You can download anything from here.